Yeah, I mean, this is a, this is a movie about Lucy Cola, who is an astronaut who goes up on a shuttle mission and comes home and feels like she left something up there, an, an epiphany that she almost had, a feeling of 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 how vast the universe was. And when she comes home, she feels how small life on Earth seems. And and the only person who really understands is John Hamm's character. And those feelings get confused, and and an affair begins. But the affair is just really a symptom of this larger existential crisis she's having. And her sole desire is to get back to space, and so she just pushes herself and pushes herself, and, and as a result, um, she starts to detach from the reality around her. And, and ultimately, you know, th there is a, a spiral that happens for her character, but really it's a story about transformation. She has, just has this miraculous ability to convey what she's thinking, what she's feeling, you know, through her body and her face and her eyes. And, and so, you know, the closer that you get, um, the more that you see. Um, and, and, you know, for a story that really is about, you know, a character's interior journey, that's critical. You know, what I loved is that there was a hugely visual film, you know, with the outer space work and there's a big underwater training sequence, and yet at its heart it's a drama about people and character. Um, and so it allows you to make something hugely visual that's also, you know, very character driven. Well, I, I hope what they do is realize that behind every tabloid story are human beings with dignity who've been turned into a punchline and that that, that that is unfair to people, that, that we should recognize that they're at their lowest moments and, and we should have empathy for them because there is no redemption without the fall.